Hello and welcome to MFA 700, module number 9. This one is titled, Having It All. Let's jump right to the learning objectives. Basically the same as last week. We're doing the same types of stuff as we've done last week. So we will just kind of go ahead and go through and hit the highlights. For the module at a glance, if this is your week to submit thesis part two, and it is for several of you, please make sure you get it in as soon as possible because I really take time and effort to read these and make detailed notes so I can chat with you and I will have a limited amount of time since we have so many people doing it this last module. Under the readings and resources, there are two excellent articles that give some insight on how to balance life with writing. And that is the topic that we're going to be using in this module overall. This is an excellent little insight here in the module overview. Note, there is no one way to do things, okay? but protect your writing time and you are protecting yourself. I personally have a little sign I put on outside of my office door at home that says, daddy is writing. And that lets everyone know to leave me alone unless the house is on fire. Because otherwise I will get interrupted all the time. And we have that worked out in our house that's going to work out for different people in different ways. Moving over to the open workshop, again this is your opportunity to share your work with others and give feedback. For the discussion, I just gave you a prompt about what gets in your way of writing and what do you do to get around it and recognize that this is an issue. It happens. It's just life. So maybe a chance to reflect, maybe a chance to share some wisdom with your classmates. 9-3, this is where you submit your second thesis part if it's your week. And before we finish up, just a note about module number 10. There are two assignments that are coming up the final project of the pitch, and a reflection. Now, typically at Southern New Hampshire, we don't have any major assignments due in Module 10 because of the short turnaround time for grading. Neither one of these are huge as far as the scope of what needs to be done. But I would recommend you go ahead and take a look at them now so you can get a head start on them. When Module 10 rolls around, I will have a weekly video that breaks these down and explains how to do them, but you don't have to wait for me. You do need to get this in, and remember, no late work is accepted for assignments due in Module 10 because I have to get the grades in. So that is it for this module, Module 9. Thank you.